What are you doing? You're so cute. Head to head. So, um, he's been doing good. His weight went way up and then it started dropping a little. And um, we feed him lunch and breakfast and dinner and he generally eats it. Um, he had a little bit of loose poop, so I weighed him. And in the last two days, he just plummeted eight ounces. I was surpri very surprised. Um, although he's not that far off from his original weight because he had been gaining. So probably the loose poop. So I gave him an appetite stimulant finally. He's chowing down. He's probably just kicking in too, but he ate his breakfast. He's about to get lunch. He's sweet, acts normal. You know, he's always low energy. He's just an old kitty, but let me know if you are concerned. I, I know you brought sub Q, but I don't want to give him something that old. I think it could hurt him. So uh, I'd have to go get more. He seems pretty good. I want to see how he does with the appetite stimulant. I'm not worried, but I'm also not a vet. So I always look to your best advice. Um, I'll show you the deal. So 710, 714.5, 711.5. See, he goes up and down all the time. 710, then he hit 725 today. I was shocked, and he's been pooping and peeing like crazy. So, but he had the, the pee on the floor. A hairball and then a pee on the floor and a loose poop so kind of like last time it was like doing great and then he had well he pees him on the floor anyway you see here Nancy does he always pee on the floor the last yeah okay so I shouldn't worry about a bladder infection all right Nancy says he does that all the time so probably nothing but I just want you to know um he's sweet and loving and darling and he loves to put his head on me and he's eating and he just got an appetite stimulant for the first time since he's been here because he was eating so well on his own we saved it for an emergency and 911 what do you think so anyway I mean we're happy to take him to bed if you want us to um my guess and it really is a guess but is that he just goes up and down in life and um Hopefully he'll go right back up. He was playing in his water this morning. Now he's going to have on it. <laughs> Stop making a water spill. Nom, nom, nom. What do you got there? You need a drink? So, I mean, he seems normal. He's eating. He's drinking. Drink your water. No, I'm going to play in it. Look what he does. He spills it all over the place. Such a big towel under it. Are you going to drink or what? We're waiting. You got a spot of food in your water. I'm going to go freshen it up. Hey, sure. <laughs> What's this? You want some water? Do you want some water? Boom. I'm going to go. He got, he got a little. He puts his whole foot in it so then he gets the litter and stuff in it. Go ahead and get your water. You just want to have up me. Okay. Okay. That'll be fine. A little booty scratch. Whoop. Whoop. <laughs> you water? You wash your feet. <laughs> All right, so if you're work, <laughs> he's so cute the way he headbutts every five seconds. Come on, let's splash the water. Come on, I'm gonna go empty it anyway. We might as well ruin it. Oh, maybe he wants his fountain. He's been drinking his water. You know what? I'm gonna go put him in a playroom with his fountain. Or I'll bring his, you know what I'll do? I'll bring his fountain in here and I'll put an extension cord for lunch and see if that helps. Because look at, he seems more interested when I make it splash. What do you think? Come on, get it. <laughs> you are a project. Come on, splash. Splash, splash. Come on, splash. There he goes. Good. He definitely puts his feet in it and stuff. All right, I'm going to use this fountain just in case. All right, kitty mill.